When you get your first RV, you and your loved one are going to say, where are we going to put all our stuff? Well, let me show you. Ryan, come here. I got to tell you, this right here, so this is the Coleman Lantern LT17R. This is a couple's coach. It's 21 feet, 5 inches, roughly 3,000 pounds. I'm going to say the 17R stands for just rear storage. That is some really good storage in a coach that's not even 22 feet long. And I'm in the rear bath right now. Sure, R stands for rear whatever. It can be rear bath, rear dining. That's pretty much what this coach is. It's still sleep up to three. That is a lot of storage space, uh, ward space, pantry space. I mean, really, whatever you want to call it. When it's your RV, you can do with it as you please. This is a entry level first timers RV. If you've been tent camping, you want to get up off the ground, you want to get some features from home in camping, but you don't want to break the bank. This is a great way to dip your toe into the RV waters. I'm on the off camp side of the rear here in the shower. As you can see, it is going to be a little cramped. I got the vent right here uh, to give me some additional headroom, shower curtain, tub surround, as well as my hot, and wa my hot and cold controls for my shower, my shower nozzle, and the high rise plastic bowl with the foot flush. But the thing about Coleman, because Coleman's been making campers for 60 years and they take feedback extremely well. Uh, last year, we introduced a 21 foot RV that could sleep five, a bunkhouse model. So couples came and said, hey, what about us? We don't have four kids. We don't need to sleep five. We don't have the dogs. We don't, you know, but we want a camper that's 21 feet, five inches, roughly 3000 pounds, can be towed by the family SUV potentially, but we want it for a couple. Here you go. Up front, you're gonna find a queen size bed going east to west with storage underneath. And you got the storage lip up top. You got the finished off front. You're gonna have the wine guard boosted cable or satellite connection as well as a GFCI outlet. When I say wine guard boosted, when you get your RV, a few things you should tack on, uh, tire pressure monitoring, um, rear camera, uh, stabilization, getting like a sway hitch or weight distribution hitch uh, will really help. But getting the wine guard booster will also help not only get you signal, you can be boosted for 4G and LTE. On the off camp side is where we're going to find our side mounted air conditioner with the window right here, which is an emergency exit. Plus you have the pull down shades. Uh, and then over here on the camp side, you got your booth dinette. Storage under both sides, plush and comfortable are the cushions right here. Uh, and the table, you'll notice it's not attached to the wall. So if you want to take this outside, you can. Uh, it also reduces down and becomes the support for the bed. So technically the 17R will sleep up to three. I mean, you could probably get two kids on there, but it's, it's, it's going to be tight. You know, it's, it's not a full adult length. Um, but if you needed to do it, you could, or if you had the dogs, great spot for the dogs. Cause you got oversized window there that opens up, giving you nice breeze because over here on the campsite is another window and storage up top. Frosted glass inlay in my storage here. And this is a entry level RV. And before I get to the kitchen, let me show you what we got right here. Right there is going to be our controls. So this runs out your power awning, which is outside, cuts on your water pump, as well as check your battery and your tanks. And for your tanks on this one, you got 28s across the board, 28 fresh, 28 gray, 28 black. But look at what I got on the off camp side. And look at the space that you have here. This is a slideless RV. You're looking at barely 3000 pounds. So maybe the SUV, maybe the small, well, I mean, the small truck, small SUV, uh, just rv.campingworld.com. Go check the towing guide or bring your truck or car into Camping World and let us check it out. It's free for us to check it out for you, and it's a great resource. Frosted glass here and my storage up top. I got the countertop here with the rolled edge. I got my two burner suburban cooktop, which is match light. You just cut it on here and light it by the match. And check this out electric fireplace. 5,000 BTUs of heat there, 5,000 BTUs on the AC. So this is not that camper to take, you know, oh, hey, we're going to go camping wintertime in Buffalo. No, dude, no. Just use common sense, okay? This is your first RV, 5,000 there, 5,000 there. Um, maybe a little bit of fall, maybe some early spring camping, depending on where you are in the country. 
uh, great camper to really test it out, see what it's going to be like. Uh, it's still going to do a good job warming the area and cooling the area, especially given the fact that we're only 21 feet 5 inches. But you definitely don't want to take this, you know, winter camping. Solid drawers, full extension on the ball guides, and look, even your fireplace has a little remote. So if you're sitting in the bed, you want to cut it up and down, you absolutely can. Uh, same thing for your AC. There you go. Bada bing, bada boom. But they are both 110, so they're going to require shore power to run. This is a 30 amp coach, so just be aware of that. You got your 3.3 Everchill 12 volt fridge freezer combo right here, and your high point microwave right there. For the first time coach, for that couple that just wants to get out, go do some camping, get up out of the tent, got to tell you, man, it's, it's all you really need. It's all you really need. You're saying, Chris, we don't need, you know, waterfall showers and, you know, marble countertops and opulent blah, 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 blah. Coleman's been doing it for 60 years. They know what they're doing. They build good RVs. And where this is priced, you're not going to break the bank. So let's go check out the outside and see what I can get you there. Come on. So here we are on the outside of you and your loved ones, probably first RV, the Coleman Lantern LT17R. Once again, 21 feet, five inches, just a shade over 3,000 pounds dry. Got the manual tongue jack up front, 20 pound LP tank. Do yourself a favor, go ahead and upgrade to get a second LP tank. It'll just help out. Battery box plus the ZAMP plug-in for those briefcases to really help trickle charge that battery as you go. Just want to set it up. They're awesome. They help get more longevity out of your juice. Diamond plated rock guard down there, huck bolted frame too, just really kind of gives this coach a little bit more support, uh, which I'm a fan of. Come around to the campsite and here's where you're going to see your storage. Now you do have the magnetic clasp to kind of keep the door up, which is very nice. But you'll see uh, this is finished off. Uh, it's right under the bed, which we saw on the inside of your couple's coach. Close it down, locks into place, and of course you got the key lock. Steel step with the friction hinge door and your power awning plus your grab handle. If you want to set up some power outside, you got the GFCI outlet right there. Got the 14 inch steel rim with the Dexter Easy Lube axle, your sealed safety window. Come around to the back, your backup camera prep right there. The arch ceilings with the rain nozzles to help keep the elements, the rain, the snow off this coach. Four by four sewer hose storage, rear stab jacks. Uh, and of course on the off camp side, it's a little tight right here so you can't really see it. But you do have your terminations right there as well as the back of your water heater. And for your tank sizes on the awesome Coleman Lantern LT17R, you got 28s across the board. 28 fresh, 28 gray, and 28 black. But I gotta tell you, man, at 21 feet, five inches, just a shade over 3,000 pounds dry. For that couple that loves to go camping, you've been tent camping and now you, you want something that's just going to give you some more amenities of home, but you don't want to break the bank. You want your first RV. Dip your toe into the RV waters. This one right here is a great one to check out. Coleman's been doing it for 60 years. And do me a favor, leave me some comments down below and let me know what you like about the 17R, what you not like about it. Where would you take it? Uh, all the input that you guys give us, we pass it back to the manufacturer because they listen. They make changes based off of what the customers like and what they use. So it's, it's a great partnership to have. And of course, if you like the 17R, you say, Chris, we'd love to test it out. See if that Dynat will fit, because it'll sleep up to three. See if it'll fit the dog, the kid. Um, you can pick it up today at your local camping world. And when you do go in say, Hey, Chris told me how awesome the 17 R is. I want to check it out. Like subscribe and notify, and please leave me a comment until next time. Happy camping. I look forward to seeing you soon.